all in today class we'll be discussing as uh, some miscellaneous concepts nothing but a selenium troubleshooting okay so first and foremost when you try to download eclipse you will see some error uh, some uh, error message you will see like uh, text uh, cannot open the eclipse though java is installed it is not in a proper place or something okay so may i'll give you some tips make sure that if you download eclipse of 64 bit your java also should be 64 bit okay if you download eclipse of 32 bit your java also should be 32 bit okay remember these two concepts if you download 64 bit eclipse and if you try to and if your java is 32 bit then it compatibility error you cannot work with it and eclipse will not open at all okay so you be careful while downloading and make sure that this bits matches so that there will be no compatibility problem with eclipse and java okay yeah and once you download java go to my computer properties right click if you are using windows 7 my computer right click properties advanced system settings here switch to environment variables okay and you need to set your path here if you are using windows 7 or windows 8 so 99.99% it's not necessary to set the path because there will be some dot dll hooks which already be installed in your machine so with that os and it's not necessary to set the path but if you are going with windows xp or something you need to set the java path here so that you are eclipse will come to know where exactly java is located and it will try to open because sometimes though java is installed eclipse will not open okay it will throw some various errors depending upon your stuff so what you have to do is you need to set the java path in environmental variables and here it is select the path okay give the final word semicolon here semicolon and go to the java program files java jre and take the bin folder okay copy this entire path of bin because these are the dlls which need to be invoked when java is getting opened so what you are doing is you are taking this dlls and you are writing the system you are mentioning it in system variable path just add a semicolon and copy the entire path till bin okay you copy the till bin and just paste here and click on okay in this machine i am not doing because it is windows 7 by default a dll hooks will be there but sometimes it is necessary to do in windows 7 also depending upon the os installation happen so better you use this if eclipse is not opening so you have done with a proper you know proper compatibility is there but still if you are facing any issue that means you need to set the java path from the environmental variables so you please open this i'll show you again uh go to my computer right click properties advanced system settings and here you will find environment variables and path open this and don't disturb any other path because it's it will lead to serious problems okay don't touch any other variable and do this three things and definitely eclipse will open in your machine if you follow these steps set the path of java and make sure the compatibility matches then then for 100% sure your eclipse will get opened like this okay this is the basic stuff 
you need to know because people will get hanged here because unknowingly they'll not at all install java and they'll try to download eclipse and try to open they'll definitely receive an error because without java eclipse will not open and sometimes people will download but they'll forget to set the path of java if they are working with some xp or some other and people will not have compatibility and still they are trying why i'm not able to open eclipse okay follow this three path make sure the compatibility matches and make sure you set the path of java in environment variables okay remember the path you are setting should be till bin okay that's it sure your eclipse will get open this is how uh, this is the basic uh, to open this troubleshooting is basically for eclipse opening and now the question comes and people will start working happily but finally when they run the code selenium code their chrome will throw an error that cannot be opened and their internet explorer will throw an error that is saying it cannot be opened and there will be some different reasons and issues they'll be not opening now we will see what are those uh things which we need to overcome those to make sure this to open this browser successfully okay uh okay let me start freshly again i'll okay let me start freshly 